No way, oh boy, don't break this. Ah, shit. Oh shit. Hello everyone. My name is McHugh, and welcome to the 11th day of Vlogmas. Now today, I'm going to attempt to make these holiday cocktails that I found online. Never made a cocktail, nor have I had one, so we'll see how this goes. The first cocktail we're gonna make is the Retro Rum Punch. Uh, I'll have pictures of what it's supposed to look like because I doubt I'm gonna make it right and I'm not doing any of that fancy garnish stuff. So for this drink, we're gonna need one cup of dark spiced rum, one cup of white spiced rum, two cups of pineapple juice, two cups of cranberry juice, and 12 ounces of ginger ale. It also asks for ice and, uh, for the garnish, frozen cranberries and sliced pineapples. Now. I live in the Midwest, so we don't have any of that fancy stuff, so I'm gonna not do that. And I'll put a link down in the description for all of these recipes. So it looks like we don't even really need to, like, do any fancy things with it. We just kind of put it in a glass and then just stir it and make it. One cup of stark spiced rum. I really hope I got the right alcohol for this, because I was not exactly sure what was what per se oh you know what this is for um this is for like a punch bowl that's a lot of rough for just this tiny little glass i'm gonna turn it into one fourth if there are cups so that way it'll be a little bit more manageable so this is one fourth of uh, dark spiced rum one fourth of white rum two cups of pineapple juice i think that should come up to like a cupping one fourth I think if I if I took one fourth of a cup of the alcohol, so I think it'd be a cup and one fourth. Yeah, I think I think that did that right. That sucks. That's like half. That's like one half between one cup and three fourths of liquid. So that's super annoying. Whatever fraction number that is. All right, it's coming along, and then I'll add another one fourth real quick. Two cups of cranberry juice, which I will do the one cup and one fourth again. Okay, that should be- oh no. That- I'm gonna need a bigger glass. That- is that still- oh my god, that still might be too much. Alright, so this recipe wants to play hardball, well, two to play that game. Both of these in here. Technically it is a punch, the recipe is a punch, so it kind of makes sense I'm putting in like a giant bowl. Add another one fourth in it, I think. Crap! No, I lost my train! Oh no, did I already put the last fourth in? Uh, I think I didn't. I'm, I'm just gonna do it. And 12 ounces of ginger ale or ginger beer. So what would be the conversion for that? I'm just gonna guess it. I'll go... Six ounces? I think this does look like the same color as in the picture. The recipe just tells me to stir it. I can't really taste the alcohol. I'm not exactly sure if this is how it's supposed to taste. It's not bad. It actually tastes really good. Next we have Rudolph's Tipsy Spritzer. Okay, this also looks like a lot. Like, like the very first thing is five cups of orange juice. That's a lot of orange juice. Well, as they say, go big or go home. One. Three. Four. Five. Two cups of chilled lemon lime beverage. Uh, mine are not gonna be chilled. Ichi. That's a little bit more than two, but this is actually one I was already drinking in the process. One and a half cups of vodka. Or one out for the Russian homies. And, uh... A little more. A half cup of maraschino uh, cherry juice? Ma maraschino cherries. So I couldn't find any juice, so I just found the, the, just the cherries with juice in it. So that's what I'm gonna do for mine. There we are, holy crap. This is, uh, this is almost, uh, almost to the top. Pretty close. And one fourth cup of fresh lemon juice. This lemon juice that I found at the local grocery store, so I'm not exactly sure how fresh this is. I guess then we just stir. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree. <laughs> I don't remember the words, only Christmas tree. I don't know why I started singing, because I'm stirring the symbol. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, are you old enough to drink? This is another thing that you're supposed to serve over ice, but I don't have any ice, so put some ice in it. Alright, that's just Oh, shoot. That's as best as the, uh, I'm gonna be able to show you, because otherwise I'm gonna tip this over. Alright, that's gonna be weird, but... Okay, where's my paper towel? Hmm? Hmm? It's not 
bad. It's a weird combination of like orange juice and cherries. I'm not the biggest fan of cherry flavored, so it's kind of meh to me, but I'll still drink it. The last thing we're gonna make is the holiday milk punch. Wait, punch? I don't know why, but milk and punch in the same liquid sentence beverage sounds kind of funky to me. So for starters, we're gonna need two cups of milk. I had a thought that I didn't need any more milk, but honestly, I probably need to go back to the market uh, to get more milk, because I have enough milk to make this drink, but as much milk as I go through on a weekly basis, yeah, I'm gonna need some more milk after this. I, kinda, I hope this bowl is gonna be big enough to hold all these fluids. Two cups of half and half. Again, me being the dummy, I was not sure if these uh, little jugs would be enough for two cups, so I bought two of them because I am a smart man. Oh, that's getting full. That's getting, that's getting, that's or, it's already halfway. Nick, you dummy, you didn't need to buy two of these. This area is like already leaking. Like, is this leaking? Something's leaking. One cup of brandy or bourbon. I'm using uh, brandy for this, which I don't think I've ever had brandy. I've had bourbon, well, bourbon flavored beer, but it's alcohol. Should taste fine. Alley. One half cup of sifted powdered sugar? Really? Half a cup of sifted powdered sugar. Okay, I, I guess I'll try to do that. Well, this is granulated sugar. I hope that's the same. So as you may have known or guessed, I am not a uh, cooking channel. So a lot of these, this, these angles are pretty amateur. All right, well, uh, I tried. Ooh, that's weird. That's, that's weird. What's that gonna taste like? I don't know. I'm so curious what this is gonna taste like. Uh, but I'm probably making it all wrong though. And finally, one and a half teaspoon of vanilla extract. God, I always have these little tabs underneath. I Am I the only one that hates these other tabs when you open these beverages, these fluids? I know I'm super annoying. Like, you know what? Write in the comments if you also do not like these tags. I know what their purpose is for, but I just hate them. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. That's 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 a bit much. No, I need more. Here we go. That's one, and then I need uh half half of half of a tablespoon. Not not, not a perfect sticking of the landing, but I did okay. Oh, that's floppy. That's, that's that's very floppy. And of course, crushed ice, which I don't have. Oh no! I need freshly grated nutmeg. I. I did not get that at the grocery store. Crap! Well, this might be taste a little bit different. Uh, I actually do remember what's, what this one looks like. It looks delicious, but his mine's definitely not gonna look like uh, what the picture is gonna be. So this one says whisk, not stir, whisk. Ooh. Ooh, that, that feels thick. It's the sh I can feel the sugar in the bottom. That feels weird. That feels super weird. We have a red nose reindeer, have a very shiny nose, and if you ever saw it, you can make what? You can even say it glow. There we go. All the other reindeers. Look at that. Some, go ahead and call him names. There's still a lot of sugar in here. Then I've left four Rudolph. I think there's more sugar in here. Three nine reindeer games. Then one foggy Christmas Eve. Santa came and said, You got a drink? Love with your nose so bright. Won't you fill my flask tonight? Alright, I think that will do it. So, let's give this a try, shall we? This is supposed to taste like, uh, milk. Holiday milk punch, I think. That's that's uh, milk and punch just sounds weird. Oh, 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 I did not make that right. Oh, I'm not. Mm. <coughs> wow, why is that so bad? Why? I'm not sure if I need the nutmeg in here to fix it. But I need something else. I'm gonna try putting some uh, chocolate syrup. Alrighty, let's try this again, but with some chocolate in it. Uh, yeah, screw it. Oh. Well. Oh. Not sure if that made it better or worse. Oh, I'm not so sure. I'd have to probably give this a pass. I mean, I drink it because I like alcohol, but 
this was definitely the worst of the three that I made. So that is all that I have time for today. So thank you so much for joining me on the 11th day of Vlogmas. Got one more day left. I'm super proud of myself that I made it this far. And let me know if you try any of these drinks. And let me know what you think of your drinks yourself down in the comments below. I would love to talk about alcohol. I love talking about it. Anyways, that will do it for me. Thank you so much for joining me again. And I'll see you on the 12th day of Vlogmas. Bye-bye.